Upgrading your sprinkler timer is easier than it sounds. For most upgrades, the only tool you'll need is a screwdriver. First, take note of your old timer settings, including the start times, run times, and watering days for each zone. You'll use these later when you program the new timer. Next, unplug the power and label each sprinkler wire with a small piece of tape. Then, disconnect the wires. Remove the mounting screws and take the timer off the wall. Hang the new timer in its place and secure it using a second mounting screw. With the cover removed, connect each sprinkler wire to the same number zone. Connect the common wire to the common terminal. Finally, attach the power transformer and plug it into a nearby outlet. To make sure the timer is connected properly, activate each zone using the Water Now feature. Setting the SST is simple. Because you set this timer by zones, you control the irrigation system exactly the way it is laid out in your yard. Watering schedules can be fine-tuned for each lawn area and also works with drip systems. Turn the dial to the set clock position and use the up-down arrow keys to set the time. Turn the dial to the set date position. Press the left up-down arrows to set the year. Press the right up-down arrows to set the month and day. Turn the dial to select the desired zone. Press the left up-down arrow keys to set the start time. Press the right up-down arrow keys to set the run time or watering duration. Press the pink watering days buttons to select which days to water or select odd days or even days. Press the blue watering times per day buttons to select the number of times per day to water. Repeat step three for remaining zones. Note, if more than one zone is scheduled to start at the same time, the controller will water the zones in sequence. Turn the dial to auto run. Turn the dial to select the desired zone. Repeatedly press either the two times, three times, or four times watering times per day button to cycle through the available predefined watering time offsets. Seasonal adjust can be used in wet or hot weather to ensure you're applying the right amount of water. Turn the dial to season adjust. Press the up down arrow buttons to adjust the watering time percentage for all zones. For example, moving the percentage from zero to negative 50% in wet weather reduces watering times from 10 minutes to five. In hot weather, you might adjust the percentage from zero to 50% to increase watering times to 15 minutes. To return to the normal watering times, change the percentage back to zero. Turn the dial to rain delay. Press the up-down arrow buttons to set the delay time for up to three days or 72 hours. Turn the dial to auto run. Press the green water all now button to start watering. The screen displays which zone is being watered and the number of minutes remaining for that zone. Turn the dial to select a zone. Press the purple water one zone now button to start watering. The default run time is 10 minutes. Press the up down arrow buttons to adjust the run time. To stop manual watering, turn the dial to auto run.